Hi guys, let's learn how to upload files using Selenium WebDriver. Let's look at this test case. So on this page, let's select some file and let's upload it. When file uploaded, we have this file uploaded text and the name of our file. And that's what we need to verify. And as you know, WebDriver is the browser automation tool and it cannot interact with uh, system windows like this one. There might be some libraries or other tools we can use to select files in this iOS dialog window, but there is much simpler solution. Let's inspect this element and as you see this is input element. So we can use send keys command on it, same as with typing text into fields. So basically we just need to type path to our file and then click on this upload button. And this should do the job. Here are the steps in our new upload test class under new upload test package, uh, image upload test. Uh, first we open in file uploader page, uh, new page object. Then on this page we select in file and here's the file name. Uh, we have, I also added this files folder under source main resources and there are few different files here. So for this test we will select logo.png file, this one. So using new method select file, push upload button, then get file names from the new next page, well the same page just after file uploaded and verification that file names contains our file name. Now let's go to our file uploader page object and look at this page object. So here page URL, uh, open page method to open this page using its URL, uh, three locators choose file field locator. So this is the input field uh, where we will send the path to our file. Upload button locator and uploaded files locator. So this the, the, the field where it prints all the files that we uploaded. And now few methods here. So push upload button, just click on upload button. Select file method which receives file name and in this method, so first we need to create string file path and I use this smart way. So in, we can we can do the full path like C, users, Dmitry, downloads where the file is located or uh, some file or C, users, Dmitry, Eclipse, works, um, Eclipse, Photon, workspace, advanced selenium web driver, slash source, slash main, like this full path source, main resources, files, and then file name. But when we, uh, let's imagine we push our project to GitHub and then somebody else, like, like you guys. So I created this uh, method with my, with the path to the file on my computer with, with uh, C users Dmitry uh, folder, but you download this uh, project to your workspace which is under different location so you will have to fix this path. So instead of using this full path here's the better way. So system get property user dir uh, which will basically return uh, the location of our project of the advanced selenium web driver project. So whatever the name of your uh, workspace or wherever you put your uh, project, it will return the path to your project. And then we just add in source main resources files, so this files folder, and then the file name. So this way uh, you, when you download this code from GitHub, if you do not to type and just go to GitHub and copy the code, you will not even need to change anything, it will work for you. So then we use type method from our base page object and for the text we need to type we send in file path and the locator of our input method and then login for file selected. And the last method just get names, get text from our uploaded files locator to verify that 
names there contain our logo.png name. And that's it. Uh, so let's uh, go to our test suite, new test suite I created to run this test. And let's run it. So right click, run as test ng suite. And let's see if we are quick enough to see the uploaded file. So page in full screen, well, almost. But we see test run one, failures zero. And when we expand console, page open, selecting logo PNG file from files folder, clicking upload button, uploaded files, logo PNG. So here's the all the uploaded files. And so this text contains our text, test best. And you can try and run this test with different um, file. So you can change the file name here or just create new test for each of the files we have here. So test for index.html file, logo file and text.txt file if you want. If you want to learn more about test automation, learn how to build full stack test automation framework with Selenium WebDriver, check out my Selenium tutorials on Udemy. You can use this promo code to get any of my courses with discounted price. If you want to get my course free, just bring your friend, let them use this coupon to purchase my course and I will give you any of my courses free.